Yo friends, this is Rob from One Page Love, and this week we're covering... Yo friends, this is Rob from One Page Love, and this week we're covering a slick JS tooltip library, the world's blackest black, some Q&A, and more in the design and development space. So my work here is done, friends. Unfortunately, this is the last episode of Yo. The truth is, I just came to out-sub the foot fetish Rob Hope YouTube channel. <laughs> A massive shout out to this week's show sponsor, Flywheel, who offer incredibly professional managed WordPress hosting. Once your site is up, they take care of everything from nightly backups, optimizing speed, security, and more. Just a reminder that all the links to everything I mention are below, so sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. A brand new innovative screen design tool called Phase has just been announced. There are totally some big players in this space, but I must admit the promo video was beautiful and the features list impressive. They're launching in the US summer this year, and if you sign up to get notified, you'll get access first. Around six years ago, Vanta Black, aka the world's blackest black, was first showcased, apparently absorbing 99.9% .9 of light. Recently, the color was demonstrated by architect Asif Khan at the Winter Olympics in what he calls a window looking into the depth of outer space. The 33-foot tall building is sponsored by Hyundai and is meant to represent the universe, the origin of hydrogen. Playbook is a new online resource with actionable career advice for designers. I'm probably stepping on toes here, but I'd say this is basically Quora for designers, except it features a very unique perspectives filter. All the advice, aka actionable items, can be sorted by male or female perspectives and even more. GoFan Kevin submitted this lovely lightweight vanilla JS tooltip library called tippy.js. Weighing in at only 14 kilobytes, it offers a solid array of placements, arrow styles, triggers, animations, transitions, themes, and even tooltip HTML templates. So Baymod Institute have blogged that captures have an 8% fail rate and a 29% fail rate if those are case sensitive. I think the current state of online stats is horrific, so I dive deeper to learn their benchmark database has more than 6,000 performance scores. So there's definitely some girth to the stats and worth considering if capture is currently a speed bump on your website. <music>
Brazilian dev and student Leo Ratzliff teamed up with his designer bro to launch this typeface foundry side project called Typer. So to study and practice typography, they are creating fonts and just giving them away for free. Right now there are only three, but I could just see by the tone in his email that his intentions are sincere and I want to feature them. So totally some self-promotion, but I coded up this HTML template called Split that I actually use on my personal website. It's pretty minimal and features a centrally divided layout where the one side can be a big image, a self-hosted video, or even an embedded YouTube video. Usually priced at 29 bucks, our sponsor Flywheel Managed WordPress Hosting is totally giving away this insightful ebook on how to get more clients for your design agency. The ebook chapters include how to streamline your process, carving out a niche, networking, boosting current business, designing marketing strategies, and keeping your skills fresh as. So the ballpark software helps you time track projects and then easily invoice afterwards. Their pricing starts at $19 per month for one person and then adds $9 per additional member. So on their pricing page, there is a fun pricing estimate slider I wanted to feature. As you get going, the amount of food increases below. Of course it's not necessarily, but you immediately smile with good vibes towards the brand. So Mark Forrester commented, if I'm inspired by Zuck's one shirt ritual, obviously referring to my red shirt each week. I'd say a small part is definitely I wanted flavor in the show and red is a vibrant color to center the setting around. But it's definitely mostly part convenience as I don't have to worry about what to wear each week as I have to worry about lighting, sound and loads of variables like the dog barking. But I actually have three of these red flannels, so we sorted. Rad, if you have any other questions on design, development, one page websites or life in general, simply comment below, send me a tweet at Rob Hope and the best will get featured on the show. Okay, question of the week. Please comment below, what did you honestly think of the techno time lapse? I'm really trying to push the boundary a bit for a design and development show. I'm trying to see where this limit is. And you know, sometimes it's gonna work, sometimes it's not. Mad love once again to this week's show sponsor, Flywheel Managed WordPress Hosting. If you like this episode, hit that like button. If you dig what I'm doing, why not hit subscribe? Or even better, head over to robhope.com forward slash yo, sign up to the weekly newsletter and get all the links to everything I mentioned straight to your inbox. Till next week. <laughs>